Hey guys, Zominator100 here, doing another review. Haven't done one in a while. This is of a knife that I got from my buddy TechnoGuy44 in a trade. And it's a cold steel tie light. Yes. Right, now that's just the box. Here's the actual knife. It is a used knife, and I have been carrying it for a little while now, and I'm, I love this knife. It's a great EDC knife. Sorry about that little fingerprint on there. Can't stand those. With the very high polished shiny blade. Great, great knife. Let's um go over uh, what the specs of it are first. Alrighty. So it's the four inch tie light. The blade itself is four inches. The overall length is eight and three fourths inches. The blade thickness is thirty three millimeters. It's not too thick, yet not the thinnest. The blade steel is Japanese OS 8 stainless. It's really nice steel, holds a very, very, very nice edge. It's also very sharp. The weight, 3.5 ounces. It's a little heavier knife. Um, it has a grivery skeletonized handles, so you can see the liners. The, those are not skeletonized. Very cool. Has a stainless steel pocket clip. I'm not the biggest fan of Cold Steel's pocket clips, but that's just a preference. They're a little, a little too tight and not not the best. Not and it's also not a very low riding knife. The opening, different ways you can open it is just with the thumb stud right there, the pocket quillion, or a little flipper on the back. I like just using the thumb stud. Doesn't require a flick or anything. Just a little pressure on it and it flies right open. There is it open, and see you can see the two quillions. It makes it adds a little more of a stiletto look to it, and has a cold steel's very thick, heavy duty liner lock, which I'm actually pretty happy with. Um, the quillion itself works very well. I don't have a pocket on me, so just use this. Flip it down, really nice. However, with the reverse flipper, it doesn't give that much, so it kind of just slides open a little so it has gonna have to add a little flick to it to get it open very good knife very very sharp as well uh... for EDC use I recommend this as light EDC nothing too heavy I mean this isn't the heavy duty knife it's very sharp and get a lot can get a lot done like packages letters whatnot just more of uh... paper or uh... food food prep not very uh... hard cutting camping knife um, let's test the blade real quick. Just a piece of paper. Nice and sharp. Now let's try the tip. Very nice. Let's get one more in there. Very nice and sharp. Great knife. Um, might need some touching up, but that's alright. Just, just a little something, something. Uh, good, good knife. Recommended for anybody out there. Not too expensive on Cutlery Shop. They were at the Cold Steel Garage sale, so they had everything sold out recently. But they got them back in stock, and it's like thirty something, I believe. On, uh, don't quote me on this, but I think it's like a little, little over thirty-five on CutleryShop.com. Great guys with great prices. Um, shipping isn't. Uh, I've had some good experiences with shipping and some bad but you know what it's, it's well worth it for what you pay great knife overall keep on keeping on guys peace